also check it out guys, we're back with a brand new episode on the channel. My name is of course General Tony and welcome my friends to what is going to be one of the best troll episodes you have ever seen here on the YouTube channel. A couple of days we got ourselves the brand new super troops inside of the game guys and one of the most powerful if not the most powerful troop to ever land inside a COC is now of course the super witch which takes up an incredible 40 housing spaces guys which is kind of crazy so what we're going to be doing in this episode take a look at this guys we are ready for one of the craziest troll bases ever my friend night hunter has made a town Hall 13 troll the rule is we've got to drop all the troops right there inside of the little square and we're going to see where they go and what actually happens to the super witch are they going to make it all the way down the other side, or are they going to get absolutely destroyed? So, before we do any of this, guys, I do want to say if you do like troll episodes, if you want some more troll bases, because I was thinking to do another one on Thursday, then go ahead and drop a like on the video. Do not forget to subscribe, guys. And I also want to give a shout out to every single member of the clan, the Phoenix, Loading, Night Hunter, and every other person, guys. This is honestly the most friendly, the best clan on the planet. So if you do want to join the clan, then go ahead and try. If we go to the clan hashtag, it is there right on screen. There is only 42 people in the clan, guys. So let me know down below if you do want to join and you want to be part of some videos. All that being said, let's click the attack button. Oh, damn. Where's my troops? Oh, wow. Wow. It doesn't actually let you use a super troop. Guys, that is weird. Where's my siege machines? Where's my spells? I don't know what's actually happened. You need to create an army first. Be sure you are ready before starting the friendly challenge. Edit army. Oh, okay. So what we're going to do, we are going to bring ourselves. For some reason, it doesn't actually let you use... Oh, no, there we go. Super troops on the other side. That's cool. So... We're going to go with a full capacity of super troops. This is going to be crazy. We're going to go for, we're going to go for 6. We're not going to bring more than that. I'm going to go for some haste spells. I'm going to bring some free spells and we are going to bring I would love to bring clones, but they don't actually clone the super witches. We're going to feel a lot of wall breakers because I feel like those are going to be necessary, guys. So let's go with 20. We might change it in the next attack. And let's also go with a... Let's go with a double rage. Okay. Now we just need a siege machine. But I think we're good to go. Let's click the attack button, guys. And let's get this underway. So, this is going to be the rule. The only thing we can do with the heroes is clear the buildings on the sides. So, I'm going to drop in the... I'm going to drop in the king the Warden, and the Royal Champion. And I'm going to pop their hero abilities all at the same time to take out all the defending troops, guys, and make a funnel this side of all these buildings. Over on the other side, we're going to get the Queen in, and we're going to try and take out all the structures down there. We haven't actually managed to take out the defending Queen yet, so it's going to go down. There she goes. And now the Grand Warden and the Royal Champion are going to head into the base where they will get absolutely destroyed by those defenses. So, let's pop the Queen's ability to clear the buildings on this side. Once the ability is gone, we should be able to send in the Super Witches, guys. Now, we're not going to be using any Siege Barracks. We're not allowed to use any Siege Machines at all. All we've got is six Super Witches and, of course, 20 Wall Breakers. Let's see what happens. Here we go. Okay, so first thing we're going to go with is the Super Witch. We're going to do... Oh, damn! Quadruple Giant Big Bomb. That is crazy. That's why we need to clear these buildings on the side. So let's drop in the more Super Witches. For some reason, they're all going that way instead of heading straight for the Wizard Towers. I think what we need to do... We need to do this again. Except we really need to clear these buildings on the right, guys, and the buildings on the left. So we're going to do it a little bit better in the next attack. But let's just see what happens this time. How far are these Super Witches actually going to go? 
Let's see, guys. The Giants are wiping these buildings out pretty quick. I'm not going to lie. Once they've taken these out, are they going to try and enter back into the base? Let's drop in all the wall breakers. Let's go in with a final Super Witch. And let's see where we go from here. Here we go, guys. One more building to take out. Now we are entering the Dragon's Den. Let's see what happens. All the Giants spreading into the core. Let's go with the free spell. The double haste, guys. Let's see if we can break into the actual town hall area. I'm going to drop another free spell down. I'm not going to use the final rage just in case it doesn't give me it back from my clan castle. Because we're going to try this again. Let's go for a second attempt, guys. That really didn't work out too well. We definitely need to clear either side before we actually go in for that major attack. Let me just donate a rage spell. So... Let's see, what other armies can we create? Six Super Witches. Maybe we'll use some Headhunters just to take out the heroes. I think that would be, a, I think that would be the best idea. So let's message Night Hunter. Let's go for a second attack, guys. And let's see what happens this time as we change up our strategy. Okay, edit army. I'm going to remove all the wall breakers. And I'm actually going to bring three... Four, five, six headhunters and a couple of minions. Let's do this, guys. Here we go. Okay. What are we going to do this side? I've got a better idea. The king's going to go down there. I'm going to pop his ability instantly. We are going to use the Grand Warden and his ability. And we're going to drop in all six headhunters to take out the defending heroes. Over on the other side, we're going to pop the Queen ability instantly to take down all those buildings, guys. And now, all we need to do is wipe out these structures and we will be good to go. Okay. Queen is doing an amazing job. Already cleared the other side. All the little Night Hunters, sorry, Head Hunters, are still alive. But they are probably going to go down pretty soon once they've taken out the Grand Warden. There he goes. The King is almost down as well. This is looking much better. So we've got over two minutes on the clock. Can we make it all the way into the town hall using the six super witches? So let's prepare the army, guys. Final few buildings about to go down on the right hand side. Let's wait and see. Here we go. One more elixir storage to go. One more gold storage. One more elixir collector. And we are ready. Okay, so I want to try and miss these bombs. So let's go with a double haste. I don't know if this is actually going to work, guys. Get ready. Here we go. Six Super Witches run. Look at that, guys. Straight through the bombs. We don't actually have any heal spells. So this isn't really going to go too well. Because we've already got blasted by these horrible giant big bombs. But those giant skeletons are ripping through these buildings. You know what? We're going to need backup from the Royal Champion. Let's go with a freeze. Straight onto the actual Inferno Towers. Let's get another haste spell down that right-hand side. And let's see where we are, guys. The final Super Witch is about to go down as we manage to take out all the single-target Inferno Towers. But it just doesn't look like we're going to be going much further. So I think it's time to try one more time. Except we'll maybe give it a go with a different troop. Let's try a different troop, guys. Okay. So, we've done Super Witches. Obviously, they got absolutely blasted. But you know what? They did kind of make it through that first trap of all those giant big bombs. So, let's go for another go. And let's edit the army. So, I'm going to remove the Super Witches and the actual Headhunters. And we are going to give ourselves... Let's go for a different super troop, guys. Let's go for the um, Inferno Dragons. I haven't actually tried these at all. So I don't know how good they're going to be. I'm going to bring... Let's go for some wall breakers, guys. Okay, there we go. Let's do this. Here we go. The Inferno Dragons, 18 of them. Wow. Let's see what one of them actually does because I haven't used these yet. So we've got one... Kind of just looks like an Inferno Tower on the Dragon's Head. Obviously, I think it's just copied out of Clash Royale. So we are once again going to take out all these uh, these heroes. 
on this side of the base. And we'll see where we go from there. So we've used the Grand Warden's ability. Hopefully we're going to be able to take out the Queen. There she goes. And we are looking good. Okay, so the Inferno Dragon's making the funnel. Let's just open up these walls, guys, because we can. Oh, damn. This little wall breaker, I thought it was going to trigger all the traps, but it didn't. And now we are ready in a couple of seconds once the final few buildings go down. You know what? I'm actually going to rage up these troops. Should we do it? No, let's not. Let's keep the rage spells. Okay. Inferno on the left got five buildings to go. Troops on the right are getting absolutely destroyed by these point defenses. Still going to take out the defending queen though, so let's not speak too soon. Let's see what happens. I've got one more wall breaker. We're just going to use it there. And all the Teslas are going to come up and the rest of the troops are getting melted so quickly. And now we're pretty much ready to send... Oh, we still need to take out these troops, guys. Let's do that with the uh, Inferno Dragon. The Queen is about to go down. There she goes. And now the Grand Warden's getting surrounded. Okay, we're ready, guys. One minute, 28 seconds on the clock. Let's prepare the Inferno Dragon army. I'm going to get the haste spells ready. So let's go with one, two, three, and a rage. Here we go, guys. Inferno Dragons to the rescue. Let's see what happens. More haste spells, rage spells, freeze spells at the ready. Let's go with another freeze right onto the central Inferno Towers. Looks like the Inferno Dragons are melting this base a lot quicker than those Super Witches. Wow. Wow. They're actually doing a really good job, guys. They are melting this base, but obviously without the Grand Warden, they're really not going to go much further. And it looks like it's the end of the road as they enter Inferno Hell. So many Inferno Towers absolutely destroying them. And yeah, I would say these Super Troops are no match for a troll base like this, guys. So this is a troll episode. Obviously, it's something different. We don't usually do videos like this, but if you do enjoy it and you want to see something maybe, I don't know, slightly different than a maze base. Go ahead and drop a like on the video. Make sure you are subscribed to the channel and keep your eyes peeled for the next episode coming shortly.